everybody, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, I'm Lauren. I hope that you're all continuing to stay healthy and safe. And well, today's video is going to be an Aritzia clientele haul. So clientele started, I believe, well, it started for me on a Monday. Today is Saturday, June 12th, so it started at the beginning of the week for me. I know that there are a couple of tiers and then it, the sale opens up to the public. I will try and link all my information that I know about clientele down below, as well as sort of the discounts and things like that. But if you want to know more, go see my friend Antonia, who you probably already know. Her name is Hello Harley here on, Aritz uh, on YouTube, and she's Aritzia queen, so she knows everything about the sale. Um, but I am really lucky because my essay is also my friend, and so she had messaged me, um, about a week and a half prior to the sale just asking me what I wanted to order so nothing would be sold out. So I got the majority of the items in and then I have three items on special order so those will be sent to me later but I did take some clips trying on items yesterday too so everything um, I will do a try on here of everything that I got and then everything that I sort of the additional things that I tried on um, in store I will also show clips of those and explain to you why I didn't get them because there are definite reasons why I didn't um yeah I keep saying um I need to stop I've had too much coffee oh before I get started I should probably mention the jewelry I'm wearing in this video so these two items so the necklace and the bracelet are by a company that just started up in Toronto so I love supporting Canadian brands it's by a brand called Posh Dash you can't see there that's just a cute packaging they gave me but um it's by Posh Dash, I will link everything down below. It's all 18 karat gold plated, which I really, really like. Came in this cute little sort of microfiber, sort of suede look, um, little jewelry holder so you can stash things in there. But this is called, let me get closer, the Teardrop Coin Necklace. You can see it's just textured. It's textured on both sides so you could wear it either way. And it hangs really low, it is adjustable, so you can decide like what length you wanna wear it at if you want to layer it and then this I'm sorry for that noise outside I live on a very busy kind of street and then this is the toggle bracelet and as you can kind of see it does have the toggle there which is really nice it's braided and it's really easy to take on and off which I love so I will leave the information down below they sent me these items they sent me a few more but I'm just wearing these two today um, they sent me these items and they also sent me a coupon code. I am not being um, compensated in any way, shape or form. I'm not going to make anything if you use the coupon code. It's just for you to save some coin. Okay, so let's get on to this haul. So like I said, I will also include the clips of the items that I tried on but didn't purchase and I will explain to you why. So the first thing that I picked up are a pair of jeans and I'm typically sort of like a like a skinny jean or a slim jean wear, but I decided to get into the whole kind of looser, baggier trend. So these ones here are the Joni. So it's by Denim Forum, which is a house brand of Aritzia. I have the Arlo's as well. And these are called the Joni and they are the high rise loose. They have tons of different colors um, and styles with it, with Denim Forum. But um, I picked up the ones that are called, picture this blue and with the rip. And I got mine in a size 25, so I would say size down in these. I'm typically like a 26. And these are what they look like here. Um, the 25, I still have a gap in the back. And they are, they're like comfortable. I know they'll probably stretch out because they're 100% organic cotton, which is good. Um, but they are comfortable in the sense like there's still like room. So I can sit comfortably, I can eat comfortably with the size 25. So. I didn't try the 24. The 24 might have been okay, but I'm not a 24. In what world am I a 24? Um, so yeah, these are them here, and they have a rip, as you can kind of see, on both legs, but they're not like an obnoxious type of rip, so I could still get away with wearing these to work. Again, I dress pretty casually at work. I'm really lucky. Um, and these were regular 128, and I believe they came to 102 with the discount, so not bad for a pair of jeans. Um, I feel like jeans are also an investment. All right, so here is the Joni jean on me. You can see that 
The 29 length inseam fits me pretty well. I am 5'5", five five and I feel like it hits me just above the belly button and then at the feet. Um, I can wear like chunky sneakers with it if I still wanted to, or I could wear sandals. Um, I really like this color as well. It does have some distressing at the knees, but I mean, it's nothing too sort of extreme where I couldn't wear this to work. I so I originally ordered the carrot jeans, which I will show you in the try on. So I had ordered the 27 and the 26. The 27, I'm wearing like the white tank top and the waist was just so big. It just made me look like, like bigger than I am. Um, so then I tried on the 26 and those fit a lot better and looked better, but they're still like really baggy in the hip area and really baggy in the legs. It kind of looked comical on me, so I decided to go against those. So I also tried on a pair of the Joni jeans that didn't have the rips. My friend was actually wearing them yesterday, um, but, and I'll insert the clip as well. Both are really nice. I just decided to go with the one with the rips just because I just thought it would be good for the summer. And again, because they're not huge rips or there's not a ton of them, I can still get away with them. Uh, wearing these to work and also for reference I should give you my height I am 5'5 five five, about 120 pounds and we usually wear 26 in jeans and then like a size small on the top so for reference there you go so that's the first item that I picked up and then second item here is this shirt so this I believe is sold out in this color so I know that they have I think five or six colors but this is by denim form as well and this is the Jane shirt and I got mine in GD bone GD I've had issues with in the past but I think with this color it should be okay it is just like a button-down top it has no um, pockets on the front which I really really like and then the uh, sleeves are rolled they are fixed so you can't unroll them if you want to so keep that in mind so here's the denim form jane t or jane shirt i would definitely say size down it is very very oversized and it does have sort of like balloon sleeves which just makes it a little bit more um i guess voluminous up top so i would definitely size down but this is just a good staple to have i mean you can wear this sort of all year round if you really wanted to it doesn't really have like that super summery vibe to it um but you could wear it with like dark denim jeans if you want to in the fall or the spring or anything like that so they do have other colors because this one is sold out i know they have like a white and a black and everything like that but it's just a nice basic to have and i feel like for the price i mean is it a little bit expensive i think i paid 62 dollars for it i guess for a staple that you're gonna wear multiple times i feel like it's worth it and i feel like aritzia clothes are also depending on what you get can be a fairly good investment so that's the next item so in store i had actually tried on this shirt with a pair of a gold e parker um shorts i believe they're a size 26 they were way too big in the waist and then in the legs itself in the clip you'll see they just like ballooned out in the legs quite a bit i have very skinny legs so I would recommend sizing down so like a 25 in those probably would have been better but then the legs were just massive so there you go but this is just perfect i really like that shirt and then the next thing i got is okay so this top here it's just a basic this is called the tna Alistar top. I got mine in a medium and it is it was $25. It's made with the Arant um, fabric, which is like the soft sort of jersey. I know that there's also the Vitessia. I don't know if it's called Vitessia anymore. TNA body one's new, the TNA butter. I don't know, but this is all right. The next item I picked up is just a basic. It is by TNA and it is the Alistar top. I got mine in black in a medium because I also had the small. The small was a little bit too cropped as you can kind of see here. You'll see in the try on it is I feel like a perfect length for me just because I don't want to show midriff but it is like the muscle tee style so it has like the thicker bands at the top. It's fairly high cut and this was $25 so I mean it's a good basic they can get for 20 bucks right? So yeah, this is it. It's made with the Arant 
so it's that cottony type of fabric there or all-star tank um, it's just a plain muscle tee it's a little bit cropped I did go up a size medium and as you can see it's not super duper cropped on me so if you don't want it to hit so high up or to be too cropped I definitely size up it's still very 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 stretchy um, and super comfortable I think for twenty dollars it's just like a really good basic the next item I picked up is a dress here. I ordered three dresses in and I ended up um, purchasing two of them. So this is the first one. It is just a plain t-shirt dress. It is by Wilfred Free. It is called the Getaway Dress in black. I got mine in extra small and it was $48. Honestly, they have this in two other colors. I think white and the yucca green or yucca green, yucca green I think it's pronounced. Um, I wish it came in like a gray or a heather gray because then I would definitely buy it. It's just a t-shirt dress and as you'll see in the Tron, hits me at the perfect um, height or like length on my body. It's not too short, but I feel like this is a grab and go. Like you can wear this anywhere. You could wear this just grabbing some groceries to the beach. You could go to brunch. It's just such an easy dress and it's a little bit boxy, but you don't look sloppy in it. So I feel like for the price, I wish I had more colors because then I would definitely pick this up. All right, and here is the Wilfred getaway dress. It is perfect. You can kind of see it hits me, I guess, mid a thigh. This is the extra small. Um, the small was a little bit bigger, a little bit boxier, but this is just like the perfect sort of grab and go dress. Like if you have to go run errands or you want to throw something on over top of your bathing suit, if you're going to the pool or the beach, but I really like it. It's comfortable. It's like a no brainer. And then I also got the Wilfred only slip dress. So very sort of late to the game with this. I picked mine up in the black, the tag rip top. I got this in the size small and it was $94 by the time the discount was applied. So it's just a black slip dress. It has that sort of v-neck. It's really good because it is adjustable. So I tried on the extra small. The extra small is a little bit tight on the bust. I am like a 34B, but I feel like I have like a really big kind of rib cage area. Um, I just feel like I'm broad in general, but um, the extra small would fit if I wasn't wearing a bra, but if you want to wear a bra, if I wanted to wear a bra, the small would definitely fit better. So it's not see-through, which I really, really like, and it hits at a good length on me. It hits mid-calf. So this is just a basic. It comes in a ton of different colors. It also comes in a shorter length as well. So it can just be dressed casually or sort of dressy. And then I had also tried on the new Seda dress by Sunday Best, and I was on the fence with it. You'll see in the clip. I just feel like empire waistlines can be a little bit tricky. Sometimes they can just make you look bigger than you are. And then it also had puff sleeves. So the puff sleeves plus the empire waistline or the baby doll waistline just, I feel like emphasized a lot on the top. And like I said, I'm like fairly broad. And then my, like I'm very, very narrow on the bottom. I think it's like an ectomorph or something that I am, like my body shape. But um, in the end, I just said no because I picked up a Zara one that was a little bit similar. Um, it was fairly inexpensive though. I think it was only like $50 with the discount. So it's a decent price. And then I also picked up the, late to the game on this too, but this is the Babaton Contour Bodysuit. I got mine in the 90s contour or the 90s style. So it's a little bit harder to see. Let me see. I can get this um, it is like a round neck it's a very high round neck and then it cuts in like really like kind of like this it cuts in very deep on the sides of the arms so I really like that it just sort of makes me look a little bit slimmer I feel like on top um, so I really like this I get the hype it's so soft it's so comfortable it's like a bathing suit but even better it does have the clasps on the bottom too to be honest like in the try on in the store and even here at home I didn't clasp it so I don't know if I will ever clasp it okay and here is the 90s contour bodysuit you can see it cuts down really, really sharp, sort of very similar to like a bathing suit and high cut. It just reminds me of like wearing a Speedo, but I really do like it. I get the hype now because it is very comfortable. And here are the Joni jeans. You can see like 
there's quite a bit of room and I know that they're gonna like soften up and bag out even more but I think that will just make it look even cooler but um yeah I think I might have to pick up a couple more of these bodysuits because like I said I get the hype now <laughs> okay down to the last few items and then I can talk about some special orders that I also have so I picked up some of the new TNA body line, which I was super excited for because online they looked amazing and they had some amazing colorways as well. So the first one that I picked up is this one here, and this is the TNA body high rise. Oh, this is the three inch short. I thought this was the five inch. This one says it is the TNA high rise, a three inch short but I didn't order the three inch. I know for sure I ordered the five inch and then on my receipt it says five inch. So this is the five inch short by um, the new TNA body line. So I don't know if you can see it here. Yes, you can. So it is completely ribbed throughout, which I really like. And now I am like a completely different color. There we go. But it's completely ribbed all the way. And when you look at them, they look tiny. Like even my friend was like, they're gonna look small. They're gonna fit you though. So they're really, really tiny. These are my new favorites. So they are very, very compressive. They hold you in, they suck you in. The ribbed like material does not cut into your body and give you like that awkward muffin top. I don't know what they did, what kind of sorcery and magic is behind this, but these shorts are amazing. Um, definitely get them if you can. I think they might be special ordered now, but these were, what, $30? I got them for, I think regular they are, they can't be that expensive then. Regular they are 38. And like I said, I got these in an extra small. And then these are the TNA body ribbed atmosphere shorts in the five inch length, which are my new favorite. I feel like I have the seven inch. I've never tried the nine inch, but I really like the length of the five inch. And these ones are the ribbed ones. And they, no joke, like they really, really like, hold you and like snatch you in really nicely. So I also ordered, special ordered in the full length leggings. So the seven eighth leggings um, in the black with the TNA body. So get the ribbed ones because the next ones I'm gonna show you, which ones, which are these ones here, the tag fell off these ones, but these are the TNA body leggings as well in the seven inch so they're ribbed at the top as you can kind of see here and then the bottom is not the bottom is like a super compressive compressive type of material it's very different from the butter it's very different from the life um it's thicker for sure it's it's still soft but it's definitely more of like the athletic type of feel so these are the seven inch shorts and i should mention they do have the little tna symbol in the back but you can barely see them because they are um in the same color i don't even know you can see the black one um but i do prefer the completely ribbed ones as opposed to just the ribbing at the top and sort of this at the bottom these and then these ones are the seven inch the tna uh body ones these ones just have the ribbed waistline they don't have like the ribbing all the way down i do prefer the ribbing all the way down but these ones are extra comfortable as well and like i said these ones are um, seven inch, so they are a little bit longer. I do prefer the five inch. I do prefer the full ribbed version as opposed to just the ribbing at the top and then this kind of material at the bottom. I also ordered the seven inch in red, but in the full rib version. So they have this in a three inch, a five inch, and a seven inch. Um, and then uh, these ones I think come in the same as well, but I got, so I picked up the black seven eighth leggings in these as well as the seven inch um, in red in the full ribbed. So these ones are also good. They're just, I feel like they're not as good. These ones, perfect, perfect, perfect. And then the last thing that I special ordered, I can put a clip in of, it is the Sherelle blazer and I got mine in the light birch color in a size extra small. So that was a special order. She had ordered it and it hadn't come in yet and then she just added a special order so it could be sent to my house. Um, I think that was that is now sold out online. The color that I'm showing you that I tried on in store is in the sage green. I just wanted to see the fit of it. Um, it's very oversized so I sized down. 
So typically I get a small in most blazers from Aritzia and this one I got an extra small um, and it's still quite baggy and quite loose on me but not sloppy looking at all. So that I think is everything. Yeah, three special orders. Yeah, that is everything I got. So it's not that much. How does it always come to be so expensive? That's everything that I picked up from the Aritzia clientele sale. I might still pick up some more. I'm sorry, I keep changing colors. The lighting is crazy. The sun keeps going in and out, in and out. Like there's, it just has not stayed constant at all throughout this whole video. So I'm sorry for that, but I will link everything down below. If you have any questions, please leave them down below. And again, I will also leave the links to the jewelry that I am wearing as well as a coupon code for you. And until I see you next time, I hope that you have a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye.